Hey Taurus, welcome to the channel. This is Kelsey from Empress of Energy. I'm ready to jump into a current energy check for my gorgeous balls. Happy new moon, guys. Happy new moon. Um, how are you all? How are you, how are you all feeling? I've slept it away. Slept it. Hopefully I've set my intentions. I hope so. <laughs> um, and I've just allowed it to come in, allowed it to come in. I've been unable to get about anywhere because of my car. It's crazy. Like, I couldn't get it fixed until gone late yesterday. And then by the time I got it fixed, I couldn't be asked. Just took it as a sign. No, nope, stay in again. So I did. So, Sunday reading. How are we all? So I'm going to get us some messages from the universe. So, welcome to the channel, guys. If you're new, do subscribe. Let's connect energies. If you're returning, welcome back. I love you all. Um, I have got an offer running. Over the, well, it finishes at midnight tonight for our new moon readings. I'm gonna well, I've got an offer on for three months. Your next three month prediction, okay? So have a look at that. Email me. So let's see what's going on. So yeah, you know, with that reading <laughs> that we was talking about on Friday, that we all, well, some of us watched, that told us not to go and I tell you what, I'm glad I had a flat tire on Friday anyway, because mm. show me messages for Taurus, please, spirit, somebody rising in Venus, what does Taurus need to see today? Do subscribe to the channel if you are new. Hit the like button for me. Let's beat YouTube algorithm. Thank you. Oh, seeing that you're appreciative. When I'm connected to my joyful presence, I attract a supporter from the universe. Okay. So maybe hermit mode is over. <laughs> you're not meant to be, you're not meant to spend all your time by yourself. Um, you need to share your shit. And that shit's good shit. It's good energy. It's joyful energy. You're the joy. You're joy. You. You are the life and soul of the party. So maybe you guys didn't go to whatever you was invited to over the weekend. Maybe you lot cancelled your plans for whatever way, for whatever reason, or something prevented you from doing whatever it is that you were supposed to do. Um, don't. What I'm getting is, if that's messages for you, don't. Jump on that and hold on to it and just completely disconnect yourself from the world. That's like it will always happen. Do you know what I mean? No. Show me more. The universe loves laughter. Do you know what I mean? I surrender to a power greater than me. Yeah. So a lot of you have done some more surrendering last night. I love that. I love that. Becoming free. Surrendering, absolutely surrendering your intentions, setting your intentions, but surrendering them because you know we do have to have a little bit of I say to be specific, but some areas do need to be a bit blurry because the universe needs to work. Um, and listen, I see a lot of you manifesting someone that loves you and they come in, you're getting them, but maybe a lot of you are just you know. Surrendered it to the divine and just thought, right, well, I'll get them when I'm meant to. They'll come when, they'll, it'll come to me when I'm ready, when I'm meant to have it, you know. Just accepting, getting out of whatever state of mind that you was previously in, whether that was in like, a, well, where, 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 or why, 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 or I don't want it. Either way, you go and get it. Mm-hmm. Show me more. Does that make sense? I do whatever it takes to get closer to consciousness. Yeah, so maybe a lot of you have got a bit of shit going on in your, in your background. Um, just something that's very much connected to you, but you're trying to stay out of it. You're trying to stay in the clear, in the peace. Stay... You're not acknowledging it, do you know what I mean? Why am I not doing it? You've tried to do something like that. Um, just 
great, it's going to work well for you. Don't, so it's like, don't be triggered. Don't, don't become your surroundings. Don't adapt. Don't adapt to the fucker. Stay out of it. Stay out of it. Stay you. Stay wise. Stay knowledgeable. I am the dreamer of my dream. So maybe someone's been trying to, you know, make you see something different there. Your external circumstances, most definitely, if not another person or whatever. But it's like your external circumstances of the trying. It's trying to cloud your vision. It's trying. It is. It's trying to make you see something for, for something else. But it's like you know, you know, what's true. But it's like you're trying to get you. Shit's trying to make you disbelieve it. I don't. I don't know if that makes sense, but. It's like, keep going. Just keep going. You're the dreamer of your own dream. So you're going to get what it is that you want. you just like, you've got a lot of shit around you that's trying to make you turn away from what it is that you want. Or... Yeah. Bottom of the deck. I am the loving energy of the universe. Yeah, so you're not going to fail. Like... Again, some areas might need to just be a little bit blurred. And maybe that's what you did last night, doing some more surrendering. Or that's what you need to do. Take it as advice or confirmation. But you're, like, you know, you're the joyful presence. You're the loving energy of the universe. You're the dreamer of your own dream. You can if you, you will if you want to. Do you know what I mean? Um, law of attraction. Make sure your vibes match in your words. We've been over it. It's like some of you are desperate to not admit that you want something. Um, but you want it. And it's like, you want it because you can't have it. No, you, you want it, but because you can't have it, you're trying to convince yourself that you don't want it. Yes. Nailed it. <laughs> yeah. But who's to say that you can't? That's, you know, that's basically what you're being told. Who's to say that you, who's to say you can't have what it is that you want? Like, only you. Only you can do that. So a lot of you are talking yourself out of what it is that you want. Do you know what I'm saying? Some of it's going to be revealed. There's going to be something being exposed, coming to light. Someone's going to be reaching out. We see it all the second time. Oh, some of you are going to get news over a home, a house. Yeah. Yep. 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 Oh, right. Oh, please don't take this weird, right? I don't mean to ever scare anyone or make anyone feel a bit creeped out. But listen, you know, like I said, some of you have like, someone's been trying to find out where you live so they can send you a gift. A lot of you that that applied for, they found out, trained as well, by the way, confirmation. They found out where you live. They're going to send that gift. They found out. However, that will not be for all of you, so do not force it. For a lot of you, a home is coming in. A home is coming in. A home is coming in, and it's like a gift. It's um, it's like a nice new start, fresh. Oh, you're getting what it is that you deserve, Taurus. You so are. Uh, you're being gifted stuff. Please accept it. Accept that you're deserving of it. Like, okay. You know, like we always see someone receiving sad news and it's not you. That's Nine of Pentacles on a jazz. So that's you, male or female. This dude over here, male or female, is getting some kind of shit news and it could be about you. Could be about money. You're being told to stay out of it. Someone's trying to steal something from somebody, whether this be you or somebody else. Someone's trying to steal someone from, from you or... Keep someone away from you. Keep someone from meeting with you. I know. I know. I know what you're all thinking. Right, for some of you, yeah, you've been in a situation where it's like, fuck that. You didn't necessarily know it was that fuck that, but you got in it. And then summit came about and it was like, oof, fuck that. Can't have that. No way. Taurus, forget about it. Yeah? There's no way in the world you can have that. That's what you're telling yourself. Whatever this is about, yeah. 
Y ahí cae, es ahí. There's been something in the way which has made you feel, Oof, can't have that. There's no way I can have that. Whether that's a third party situation or whatever, right? There's been something. There's been something that's made you think, I can and won't have that. Yeah, you fucking will. Swear to God. Show me messages for Taurus, please, Spirit. Show me messages for Venus. I told you. Good lad. Someone gonna be reaching out. Card number five. Show me more. What was that? Oh, the prison. Card number 29. This is also an 11. Someone. Again, maybe it's you. Wanting to reach out, but not. Someone's feeling unable to reach out. Or they have been. Someone's unable to reach out. Oh, that's why you're so. It's never going to happen. There's no way in the world. Whatever that is. Whatever this is to do with, whatever you don't think you're going to get what you're going to hear from, or whatever that can mean, you're going to get it. Whether that's, you know, like, even a job, like, well, I'm ne you went for your dream job, you know, you went for your dream job interview, and now you're, like, convincing yourself, well, I'm never going to be able to get that. You are. Something to that effect, yeah? Let's just tell us, please. Show me, show me, show me. Some of you are going to get taken out of, yeah, something to do with your home, where you live in situation, your housing situation, where you feel imprisoned, trapped, stuck, it's ending. Someone's ending some form of imprisonment. It could be buying and selling a home, something that's kept you stuck, kept someone stuck <clears throat> from reaching out or so on and so forth. Take it as it resonates, but you're going to, someone's, there's going to be a big release. Put it that way. Massive release. Something's ending. Something's dead. Over. And it's whatever you view as stuck. Trapped. Something's ending here. Honestly, there's some kind of thing going on. If it's gonna be so different for us, so all of you, obviously, but so there could be some kind of older divine feminine energy within a dynamic that's sly as fuck. Could be trying to steal, steal, or they've been very manipulative, very sly, selfish. Right, there's something going on, put it this way, for those of you that this will resonate with, there's something going on with another energy that's com the, keeping you and your person away from each other, like, mm. That's it, Tarot. No, I'm not using that one. I'm not using that one. I don't even know why I just picked it up. Using this one. The Nine of Swords. Show me messages for Taurus, please. Someone's concerned over what options you've got, what choices you've got. If you have enough. Some of you are very focused on making better choices, changing the way you decide upon things, make decisions. Um, so 
something like that. Making better choices. Someone tell the about making better choices. The Knight of Swords. Someone's swooping in soon. The King of Wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. The Three of Cups. Oh, you're just not going to... Right, someone's going to come fucking swooping in. Oh my good lord, this is as clear as day as it can be. Great. Right, someone's going to come swooping in, flying in. Yeah. This dude. Whoever this is. Dude or dudette. No gender in tarot, guys. Um, could be a Leo. Someone's going to be cute with you. But this could be a third party situation. Or you're going to very much think it is. You're not going to believe them. You're not going to trust what they're saying. You're going to think they're a lying piece of shit. You're going to be like, well, you're a liar. So fuck off. <laughs> Two of swords. Um, they're not going to take that for an answer though. No, they're not. They're going to see that as playfulness. Someone's going to come in and you're going to block them and they're going to see that as playfulness. For a lot of your playfulness. But they're not going to take that for an answer. They're going to be like, well, what do you mean? Fuck off. No, I won't. <laughs> They won't fuck off because they want they want a new beginning. They want a new beginning with you. Something's about to be hatched. Oh. Ten of cups. Right, there you go. Reading done. <laughs> wow. That was very clear. That was a very, 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 very clear message. Very clear message. Someone could have been ending a situation, living situation. Someone could have left a home, left where... They was living, which was a prison. Someone could be reaching out from prison, but they're telling you that they're getting out of it or something. Show me messages for Taurus, please, spirit, from me, Mars, and Venus. Four of Swords. So someone don't want to let go of a soulmate connection here. The page of cups. There's someone's like holding on, clinging on to a soulmate connection. Did you release this last night? Did you try to set did you try to set new intentions? <clears throat> Whatever you've done, someone's like feeling the need to hold on, cling on, hang on to a connection. The page of cups. This cup's about to get filled. Someone wants to come and fill up this cup, but it could be a Sagittarius, Ace of Wands. Oh, there's a bit of sex coming. It's a real fortune. Seven of cups. Death. Someone's gonna put. Someone's gonna come and put an end to your confusion. I'll tell you that. Or the confusion is gonna be ended because someone's coming in that strong. You're not gonna know whether to believe them, so you're gonna block them first time around. Maybe I'll tell them to piss off. Um, for a lot of you, and they're gonna be like, nope, we're not going nowhere. Um, it's because they mean it. Wow, someone's got some big feelings for you. Shit. Someone like, someone thinks the world of you. Someone literally thinks the world of you. Wants to protect you, look after you. That's cute. I hope that's for me. <laughs> Show me messages for Taurus, please. We'll find out more when we cry in mind. Messages for Taurus, spirit. Somebody reminds me of us. Queen of Swords, okay. You're pissed off with this person, that's why you're going to tell them to piss off. The Knight of Cups, yeah. <laughs> the Star. But do you want it though? Okay, you're going to play hard to get. Not hard to get, but you're just going to let them know that you're not happy with the Queen of Swords. You're going to be, um... You're going to be very, very... Blunt with your tongue. You're going to be very blunt with your tongue. Oh, shit. The Knight of Swords. This is coming in soon, you know.
This could be already someone that's lied to you, so you're going to be like, what the fuck do you want? Um, or you're going to be like, oh, hi, it's the liar. <laughs> and you're going to, do you know what I mean? Be like, what have you come back to lie about now? Something like, but you want it. So it's like, yeah, you're just a bit pissed off with whoever this is right now. Let's clarify. Let's clarify. <clears throat> you want it though, could be an Aquarius. You want it. You know, like I was saying, you know, it's still. Stinger. But you want it. It's that five of swords again. Wait, someone's going to be like. I love you. <laughs> I love you. Should have said it. Should have said it. The high priestess. Trust your discernment, guys. Wheel of Fortune, so you can feel something on its way. Your, your body's vibrating left, right, and center. Trust them, listen to them. Divine timing's at play. There's a, something's about to restart. There's a new cycle. It's like, there's a new cycle starting. You, new moon. Have you accepted that you are not at fault in whatever this is? Like, you know, it's not your fault. It's, or even still like, yeah, well, you know, you're not acknowledging yourself. Are you doing that? Because if so, it's it's some it's some it's it's having an effect. Do you know what I mean? It's you know, like we said on Friday, or whatever day it was, where it's like, fuck what anyone else thinks. It's like to, you know, accepting what it is that you want, but it's like maybe doing that. But at the same time, hmm. Some of you are dealing with a Leo and they, they've they're a liar. They've been someone's someone's been lying about what they want. Someone's been lying about what they want. But they can't get it past your intuition kind of thing. Like Show me this four of swords, please, the Taurus. See the one got right now. Show me this four of swords, the page of cups. So someone's spilt the cup. Oh, you did. Oh. The Knight of Cups. Justice and the Hangman. So you've poured it away. You've poured it away. Look, and now this this night's been like they felt it. They felt you. You know this. Could be all the Pisces, but like this fish has fell out of the cup. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? It's like you you poured it away, um, or you've dropped it. You've really. Do you know what I mean? You've dropped it. So they're like now they're like well, what the fuck up. What like he looks a bit. Maybe you're gonna get a drunk text. Um, Cause he even looks a bit pissed or a little bit confused. Cause something's brought justice. Whatever that bit of emotion, whatever that emotion is that's fell out of that cup there, it's brought justice, it's brought justice to make someone strong Pisces energy. Uh, Cause you're looking at a situation differently. Some of you like, I don't want to say accept the, accepted the fact that you was fed a dream, um, but maybe to a degree, whatever, you know? So, you, I hope this is making sense, you looking at a situation differently for what, 
what you was told or what you was fed, yeah? I'm going to say what you was fed, what you've maybe waited for. That's being looked at differently. It's like, so whether you've even said, whether you've even said something or just done it energetically, you've dropped the emotions towards it or something to that effect. And it's kind of left someone a bit confused. Yeah, because someone's been hiding something. There's been secrecy, strong Pisces energy. We could be dealing with a Cancer or a Libra. Oh, the Tower, Page of Swords. Something's going on behind the scenes that you just don't know about, but I feel like you're gonna find out. I feel like you're gonna absolutely find out, or someone's found out about something. Um, there's gonna be something's going on behind the scenes. You can feel this again. You can feel this going on, but even still, you've dropped it, and. There's gossip, I think. There's gossip. There's... Is someone being held accountable for gossip? This is over a passion, something passionate with you. Someone's walking towards you because you're what it is that they want. Show me this two of cups, please, for Taurus. You have you've set something free. It's you've done that. It's like well, if it's meant for me, it'll come. To, if it's meant for me, it'll come for me. It'll come to me. You set something free, and it's a soul connection. Um, the three of Wands, the Ten of Pentacles, and the Nine of Swords. So, or someone, and the Seven of Pentacles. Yeah, I feel like you done enough, kind of waiting kind of thing, so you set something free, you know, you've kind of realised, maybe, I don't want to say that you've been, something's been occupying your mind too much, maybe most definitely at night time, you know, your dreams, but they've been negative, they've been negative, so you've released it, you're kind of releasing it to the wind, um, you know, you've you kind of feel like you've done all you can. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, you're still carrying a little bit of it with you, but you're going. Interesting. And this is a soul connection. One that you wanted a future with, but it's kind of like, you know, cause you was looking and waiting for that future maybe. Um, again, some, what someone fed you. Someone promised you a future, do you know what I mean? Um, but the wait for that is, for whatever reason, or the outlook, you kind of just feel like, I'm just gonna, what will be will be, kind of thing. Someone's coming straight towards you, this could be a husband, a father, um, but they're coming towards you very passionately, very, very, very passionately. Um, they find you fucking stupid attractive. So you've done something, you've released in that. It's typical, isn't it? So, yeah, because you've got your chariot. You've got your chariot. You kind of took a, you've kind of looked in the mirror at yourself. Um, you've kind of done some kind of realisation where it's like, hang on a minute, I deserve better. I deserve better. So, bye. Show me this page of cups, please. This could very well be an apology. Show me one more for this page of cups. The seven of wands. But look, this is... There could have been a lot of gossip, a lot of people involved in this. A lot. A lot, a lot. Um, someone's talking a lot of shit, or they have been doing. Someone's trying to ignore someone from talking a lot of shit, or more than one person. Someone's going to come and say sorry for, t for someone, for listening to someone talking a lot of shit. One more to this page of cups, please. Yeah, the five of pentacles. So someone's going to come and say sorry for abandoning you, ghosting you. 
um, listening to other people talk shit. Oh, they're dealing with oh, just if it's not about you, it's something that they've had going on in their shit, which which has made them ignore you. You know, so you felt ignored, abandoned, ghosted, but they've been going through something with more than one person. The group. So, you know, you just felt completely left out in the cold, ghosted, embarrassed for some of you. And that's why you're Queen of Swords are. Someone's been dealing with someone from their past and it's been bloody, it's been violent, maybe. There's been definitely harsh words being spoken, if not anything else. Um, someone from the past, could be to do with children, other children. Yeah, look, someone's been dealing with the devil. Um, someone said some ha like harsh stuff. Could do with a Capricorn. Your intuition is bang on. And it's like, if you're connecting with a fire sign, which is... Crazy to say, but specifically a fire sign, yeah. <clears throat> it's it's like your connection between the two of you is crazy. And if, like, and you find your stupid, stupid, stupid attractive. That king of, king of ones there. You might as well be biting his lip there for me. But maybe there's been somebody else involved. Someone of, like, not power in their life, but, or authority, but maybe, to some degree. Small, but still. Show me this Queen of Swords for Taurus. The Tower. You're not going to see this coming. Queen of Swords, the Eight of Swords, and the Ace of Swords. So again, that prism, you're gonna get something, some kind of truth being revealed. Someone's being released. Someone wants you to release them. Someone's got strength. Could be dealing with Leo. The Seven of Swords and the Nine of Cups. Someone's been lying about what they want and they release themselves from that. Someone's released, that's the prison and that's what you've been pissed off with. Someone's been keeping themselves somewhere um, for the sake of it. They've been lying about what it is that they want. Lying to you or lying in general, lying to themselves. But you're going to hear the truth about this. The truth is completely coming out, the Ace of Swords. Don't know how you're going to feel about it or they're approaching you as the Queen of Swords. But... Let's see what the seven of swords is, the ten of swords, the eight of wands. You're going to hear about something's ended, done, dusted. Um, someone, honestly, someone's been trying to fix a relationship and it's gone to shit, whether that be you or somebody else. Someone's been lying about, about being happy, about wanting to work with someone. Um, very selfish there. Someone's been dealing with someone very selfish. Show me the seven of swords, please. The ace of pentacles. Someone's been trying to start a new beginning with somebody, and it's um, and that's why you're on the queen of swords. Or guys, just be kept, just be mindful of someone being full of shit when it's coming when it's coming to offering you something. If it's money, it's a load of shit. But I feel like for a lot of you, you're already in the queen of swords. Energy towards this person. And they're going to come towards you with some kind of truth and you're going to be like, well, how am I supposed to believe you? I don't know what to believe. Because they've been in some kind of trapped energy, space, place. But someone's coming out of that. Someone said a lot of horrible shit and... They regret it. Someone's been talking a lot of shit about you. Show me 
Show me this night of cops, please, for Taurus. Show me this night of cops. Look, someone's ready to squawk because the tower. I have wanted to come out like that. You're not going to see this coming. You don't expect this. Uh -huh. The Empress. I know you do not. Show me this night of cops. One more. Oops. The Six of Cups and Judgment. So, as soon as there's reconciliation here, like, you just do not see it coming. Someone's going to bring in an emotional message with that night of cups energy. Someone's going to be squawking. Someone's going to be squawking about how they feel. And you're just going to be like, what? It's going to be that shocking unexpected to you like but it's reconciliation i feel like it's absolutely what somebody wants and for a lot of you you do this is wish fulfillment this is wish fulfillment this is healing from this tower someone could have already caused chaos for you and you know Yeah, someone could have put you in competition, but you didn't rise to that occasion. You didn't put yourself into the competition, but you was put in it, but you didn't play. Someone wants to protect you. Could be an Aries. Show me what this um, tower is, please. Let's see what this tower is. This is tower. Why is it so unexpected? The Hierophant, you're going to be in a relationship. Someone wants a relationship with you. Something's going to be difficult to work on, but they're willing to do it. They want to do it. They want to do it. They really do. They're very passionate about doing so. Someone's ready to take action. Someone's not fucking about. But they've got someone behind them. That's or more than one person. That's talking a lot of shit. Oh, you have. Show me the star, please, for Taurus. Show me the star in the But this is wish come true. The fool, the six of wands. Listen, the risk is worth gonna be, the risk is gonna be worth taking, and someone's someone's realizing that. Someone's jumping, but they're jumping into success. Someone's not gonna fall. Someone needs to take that leap of faith, that risk, and they're doing it, and they're not gonna fall. They're going to fall to success. The Six of Wands is winning. So that risk, that jump that you'll take over that cliff, someone will be there to catch her. Or something. Show me one more for this star. The Ace of Cups, man, yep. So the risk is going to be worth taking all day. And someone's realising that, so someone's going to take the risk and jump. You just do not see it coming. The devil. Someone's obsessed with you, though. Someone's sad about being a dick. Um, as well. You know, someone... Someone misses the sex too, but if someone made you feel a certain kind of way about someone because of deceptions and lies, they ate the fact that they ate that they've done that, they ate that they put themselves in that light to you. Um, but just trust your intuition. Your intuition is your power. Like, no joke, your intuition is your power. And you know someone's missing you. You know someone wants you. You're absolutely correct. But something's not going to be easier to be worked upon because someone else, someone outside of the connection is going to talk a lot of shit, either, a lot of shit, either to you or to your person. And it's only because they're in pain. But, mm, that's amazing. So there's going to be Ace of Cups here, something that you absolutely want. Wish come true, the star, it's what you've been wishing for. You go and get it. Let's get somebody to hold you. Mm. You're very close to achieving your goal. You're very close to achieving your goal. The risk is going to be worth it. Believe in the impossible. It's going to smack you in the face, this, because you don't see it coming. A personal show reaches resolution. Feels like a personal reading, this. Nothing yet. Nothing is yet set in stone. Get ready to be in a relationship. Messages for Taurus, please. What advice do we need? Thank you. A new start is coming. New moon. Yeah. So, whatever you did during the new moon, guys, it set something in motion big time. And I feel like for a lot of you, it's because you're kind of dropping it. Um... Not because you don't want it, but it's just, you're kind of setting it free. It's like, you know, because you feel like you can't have it. A fiery climax approaches.
surrender it. You surrendered. You surrendered it. Or maybe it's been like a, right, okay, well, show me then. Show me universe. Bring it to me if it's meant to me. And it's been brought to you. Show me one more for Taurus, please. One more for Taurus spirit. Expects powerful change, new moon eclipse, confidence is the key to your success, new moon in Leo. So, guys, you know, it all says it right there for, for me, do you know what I mean? A new start's coming, a fiery climax approaches, expect powerful change, confidence is your key to success. So, believe and you will achieve. Listen, if you believe that nothing will come of this situation, nothing will, if you believe that. But again, I know that you've released it to the universe, um, but when it comes in, do you know what I mean? Because I do see some of you questioning it when it comes in. Like, oh, hey you, hey you liar. <laughs> kind of thing. Step out of your comfort zone, North Node. Dare, dare to do it because the risk is going to be worth taking here. Most definitely for somebody. So this is what I got for you, my babies. Um, let me know if this has resonated. Like, share, comment, and subscribe if you have not yet. I really appreciate every single one of you that do, honestly. Um, donations can be made um, via my PayPal. Um, I don't know why for some people it's making me like claim and accept money. I don't know why it's doing that. It, maybe it's in a way that you're sending it. I'm not sure. So um, it just don't let me do it for some reason. But yeah. Um, I appreciate you all and I will see you tomorrow.